This year has created quite the learning curve for both students and teachers during the pandemic. We've been following Fulton County Teacher of the Year Kelsey Drew since classes started in August. And just recently, unexpected adjustments came to the Heritage Elementary School teacher due to a rise in COVID-19 cases. Here's Paula Soro with an exclusive update from inside the classroom. It may look like your usual school lunch break. Kids lined up at the door, walking to the cafeteria. All food needs to be eaten before I come get you. But in the pandemic world, as soon as you're done eating, make sure your mask goes back on your face. This is very different to what Heritage Elementary has been doing. We haven't eaten in the cafeteria in like a month. A rise in COVID-19 cases moved breakfast and lunch to the classroom for a month. I think on average, I usually have about seven kids absent a day. Then back to the cafe this week as numbers dwindle. I miss you. Yeah, I miss you. Yeah. Yeah. Because you get to watch shows. But ask Miss Kelsey Drews herself, and the return to the lunchroom means some well needed downtime for educators. So, on the days that we were eating in the classroom, I literally spent six hours straight with them. And it's, it drains your battery. And staff shortages aren't helping fill that battery up. It's just been grueling. We definitely don't have enough teachers, and getting a sub is asking for a miracle. Yeah. All right, transition. So while this may look like your usual school lunch break. Ladies, let's wrap it up. It's been a very difficult month. We're exhausted. We're so exhausted. It's one of the few moments educators are using to recharge their batteries. Well, Paula is checking in with Mrs. Drews every month throughout the school year. You can watch our previous stories on 11alive.com. Just click on the learning curve tab on the homepage.